Hey everyone, Jason Shavert here of M0A.com with Andrew of True Track. True Track has played such a role in 2.3. Mike Zulu went from a 1972 Lima model, 172, no autopilot, like stuck in the Stone Age, and you have made us modern, my friend. I appreciate that. Oh yeah, of course. Talk to us about what's in Mike Zulu right, right. now, and this is certified too, which is yep. amazing. Yep. So you run bet. us through it, man. Yeah. So. Our Vision Autopilot, it, it kind of got its start in the experimental world. Yes. It, it lived there for six or eight years, and it was actually the redesign of our most popular product to date, which yes. was our DigiFlight 2. So it's yes. got a almost a 15-year history awesome. in the experimental world, just working out all those kinks and yes. making everything perfect. Yes. And then we're able to get it in the certified world. So yes. great thing about the Autopilot is we've added a bunch of safety features to it from what we had in the experimental world. Sure. Things like our envelope protection and the emergency level button, all that yes. sort of good stuff. Yes, we have that. Are Love it. Great features in there. Yes. Uh, you got track select, you've got altitude select, vertical speed, climb, descent. Of course, min max airspeed. You can't yes. stall the airplane. Absolutely. Another one of those great safety features in there. Yes. Follow those flight plans in the GPS. Uh, you got GPS steering, GPS nav. We had the, a GPS fully coupled approach the other day on the minimums, <laughs> and it was just amazing. That's what people don't realize is that. You can take an old airplane and make it modern. Everyone thinks that you gotta buy yep. an airplane with an autopilot in it already. Like, yep. you can add one after the fact. Absolutely. So, well, first thing we'll do is we'll disengage the autopilot. We'll kind of use this one here as our primary for this, this yes. demo. So you got a couple of options to engage it. You can do it with the AP level button. Let's start there. Zero bank, zero vertical speed. We're gonna get the airplane stabilized. It takes about 10 seconds usually. Yes. And then it's gonna drop back into track mode. So now we're okay, we got the airplane stable. Now we're gonna be a track selector. We can turn this knob, boom. Now we can turn and get ourselves out of trouble, whatever right. direction we need to go. Right. right. We wanna do an altitude select. I'm just gonna push ALT, dial in the altitude we want here. Say we're gonna climb to 7.5. We'll do that at do it at 300 feet per minute. Just take yes. a nice, easy climb. So yes. now we're going to 7.5 at 300 feet per minute. Yes. Now any time in that transition, we can change both the selected altitude and the selected vertical speed. Yes. So we just click the knob over there. Now we can either drop that down or maybe we can crank it back up sure. to 600 feet per minute. Sure. Again, that min-max airspeed always in play there. Yes. Now maybe we got a clearance on up. Maybe we're going to go up to 9.5 now. Away we go, we're still going. Right. We've got a flight plan in the GPS. You see the flashing plus up here in the top corner. Yes. Push mode, now we're gonna to fly to and follow that flight plan. Yes. That can be a direct to or That's multi waypoint, so cool. either one. That's so cool, man. Just so many amazing things and adding modern technology to an old airplane. We've proven it with 2 3 Mike Zulu. You prove yep. it every single oh, day, man. Absolutely. So, it's, it's really cool. It's that's really cool. Awesome. Stuff. We're so thankful for Andrew, the team here at True Track. Check them out at Oshkosh and check out their websites linked below this video. Enjoy the rest of your day and most importantly, remember a good pilot is always learning. Have a great day, guys. We'll see ya. Thanks, guys. I wrote the Private Pilot Blueprint with the intention of, if I could do my flight training over, would I wish someone would have told me? And I want that book to be yours for free. All I ask is that you pay shipping. Visit privatepilotblueprint.com to get your free copy.